twinkle right here. And what I love most about this plant is the striking foliage shape. As you can see, it's very, very pointy. And it kind of reminds me of the Brassavolia leaves. Not in particularly reminding me of the Dendrobium. So definitely fascinating about this plant. Also, as you can see, the canes are round and plump at the base, kind of mimicking suitables versus canes. So that was unique also. And this actual dendrobium right here grows in a spike that all of the blossoms come out almost in the shape of a Christmas tree. At least that's what it reminds me of. And what Jerry, the orchid grower and vendor, had stated is that the blossoms here actually bloom in a antelope-like shape where it has the sepals or the petals that actually twist and turn, kind of mimicking the antelope horn. So definitely I'm excited to see this blossom because I've never had an antelope variety dendrobium. I find that quite fascinating. So definitely excited about this plant. Okay, it's been a little while now since we talked about this dendrobium blue twinkle. And of course, I did not get a chance to show you the blossoms in bloom. So today we're gonna do that. Which right here, you can see just how amazing these somewhat miniature blossoms are. This is actually considered a, a spatula type or an antelope type in the way that their petals and their sepals will twist around. And some of them will twist all the way backwards. So as you can see, it's not your normal variety of dendrobium. Definitely awesome. And again, I did say that it is fairly miniature in size as far as the blossoms, but because there is such a multitude of blossoms, it definitely makes up for their size. Very beautiful multitude coming off of this spikes. And of course, it's kind of like a spherical shape all the way around. So from any angle that you look at it, you will see these amazing blue twinkles. Now, what's a little bit funny and awkward about this, and I'm noticing this on some orchids, where they will entitle it actually with the name blue. This is called the blue twinkle. But, you know, as you guys can see, this is definitely not a blue flower. So that's kind of something that really amazes me. I don't know if it once appeared to be somewhat blue, because as you guys know, there really is no blue orchid. Uh, they actually consider it, even the ones that look blue, they actually consider it a type of indigo color. So it just amazes me how they would call this a blue twinkle, when in fact, I think they should have called it a purple twinkle because the color is definitely purple on this. But regardless, very beautiful and unique shaped blossom. And these blossoms actually will last about two to three months. So on top of their beauty, they are long lasting. So definitely you cannot ask for more than that, right? So I am a big fan of the antelope and the spatula variety because they definitely give you such a twist in the orchid world. And I am absolutely thrilled with this dendrobium blue twinkle. Just very beautiful, very magnificent, and indeed, they twinkle and shine. Well, I thank you guys for tuning in to yet another orchid adventure with me, Maria Young. And if you guys like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs way up. And if you want to know the latest and greatest news in my orchid world, please be sure to subscribe. And of course, if you guys have any comments, feedback, or questions, please be sure to post them as well. 
because as you guys know, I definitely love, love, love to hear from you guys. Thank you so much and happy orchid growing, everyone.